This year, the pandemic has forced a lot of nonprofits to do all of their fundraising virtually, but it can't stop one high flying event. Health specialist Kathy Walsh reports that people are lining up to rappel down a Denver skyscraper to raise money for cancer research. 1670 Broadway, 448 feet tall. Imagine rappelling down its 36 floors, but a skyscraper doesn't scare Cindy Eastman. If I can beat down cancer, I should be able to uh, hurl myself off a building. Cindy is a breast cancer survivor. It was found on a routine mammogram. She had a double mastectomy and reconstruction, and she gratefully leaned on family and friends. Cindy says September 11th will be her three-year anniversary of becoming cancer-free, and it will be the day she says thanks to her warrior squad by going over the edge. That's one of the main events that Cancer League runs. This is the 12th year more than 100 people will rappel down a skyscraper to raise money for cancer research. Event co-chair Jim Hackstaff says, despite the pandemic, Denver Over the Edge is still on. We're allowed to be, uh, you know, 400 feet from each other on the ropes, so it's a perfect event for a COVID world. For Cindy, it's one of her 50 new things to do before she turns 50 in January. She's got a team of seven. Team Gummy Bears, named after the implant often used in breast reconstruction. And Gummy Bears is a shout out to my mastectomy sisters. 36 floors down, no fear. Cindy is a cancer survivor, doing her part to find a cure. In downtown Denver, I'm Kathy Walsh covering Colorado First.